All right, here we are back at the monitor to install that power supply board that we just did the repair work on to test it out. Of course, we need to you know, plug in all of our connectors back into the board. So we'll start with our AC input. The next one we'll go to is our output to the uh, inverter. Now these connectors will only plug in one direction, so when you're plugging them in, you know, it's fairly simple as to which one uh, goes which direction. I'll ease the board back down. Tuck our cable bundle back through the nylon connector. Be sure you put your RF shields spacers back in. Those are what allow the shield to be grounded to the board to prevent uh, electrical shock hazards. So you do want to make sure that those are back in place. And you do want to make sure that you put all of the screws on the power supply board back in. Uh, again, the same thing. That's what grounds the board to the chassis um, and prevents you know, electrical shock hazards. Gently flip the board over. You want to reconnect the monitor panel to the control electronics. This little connector will just slide in. You want to make sure that it's aligned properly. Can't very well get it where you can see on the video there. snaps into place. You want to make sure that it is firmly seated in place. Then you can lay the control panel down um, to make sure that you have it in the right spacing. You can go ahead and put in the two screws that were across the bottom. That will hold it in place. shielding tape, the seven connectors for the actual backlight bulbs, and the RF shield I'll just slide on from the end. Don't forget your front control panel cable. It's going to plug in just like that. Now if you apply a video signal and a power to it, and we can lift the unit up. Power it up, and we do get our LG, and in just a moment we have output from our computer. So a monitor at this point is powering up and down just like it should. I'll try to put the back cover back on it. And we've saved another one from the trash pile and kept some money in your wallet. snaps around and don't forget your two screws they're in the center at the bottom and there we have our repaired LG monitor